lot of studies now that, uh, that, that clearly indicate that acti reactivation of this um, developmental process, EMT or epithelial tumor mesenchymal transition, uh, plays a role in um, tumor cell acquisition of invasive and migratory properties. Our research is focused on trying to, first of all, determine how EMT is induced. What are the signals that induce EMT in cancer cells? And then secondly, we're also interested in to learn more about how cancer cells that undergo EMT use their EMT properties to migrate to distant sites during metastasis. Uh, so far, uh, results from us and other also researchers indicate that as cancer cells undergo EMT in the primary tumor, they become invasive. So they, they gain the capacity to migrate away from the primary tumor. Uh, but then there are some studies indicating that as tumor cells uh, approach a distant location in our bodies, for example, if breast cancer cells migrate to the lungs, which is a frequent site for metastasis, uh, they may undergo the reverse EMT process, which is MET, or mesenchymal to epithelial transition. So that means that the EMT process may be reversible and then be regarded as a sort of a highly plastic process. It's a dynamic process where cells can maybe, depending on which location they are located in, uh, they can be uh, epithelial or mesenchymal or somewhere in between. Uh, and whether the cells that are fully mesenchymal are the most dangerous cells for metastasis, that's still under debate and under investigation, but that's part of the research that we're interested in.